Hey y'all, welcome back to Sin City Review. Today, we're checking out a SIG P250 Compact, chambered in 40 Smith & Wesson. As far as the work performed, as you can see a multicam Cerakote. Um, it's kind of a multicam blend, it's pretty cool. Uh, pretty much five colors I used. The main body is done in burnt bronze, uh, pretty much the little small spots and the controls, those are all done in my midnight bronze. And then there's kind of a fool's goldy blend of a unique color, there's a, a machete gray blend, and uh, that goes into almost a satin aluminum stainless, so a lot going on in this gun. But it turned out really awesome. I mean, it almost looks blue, where you got that dark, almost machete gray. And then of course, as it fades, I was working on trying to do like this kind of spacey space dust fade into the different colors with the camo. So you can see the main body being all burnt bronze, and everything else kind of has this fade characteristic to it, so pretty unique, or very unique actually. I like it a lot. Pretty freaking sweet. Pretty cool little double action pistol. The uh, rear side is integrated into the uh, firing pin stop, if you will, so I haven't seen any aftermarket sights for these guys yet. I mean, I'm sure, of course, the front sight's easy enough, but the rear sight, the way it's designed, is pretty unique. You actually push in this little piece right here, and the sight pops out. Kind of a cool design. Magazine's all midnight bronze, and of course, a few camo accents. That fade on the bottom is cool. All in all, I think this thing turned out freaking rad, man. Very, very happy with the end result. Double action only, of course. Pretty cool. Change the lighting up real quick here. It's not so blue now from that light. Definitely is more gray. Pretty sweet. I love it. I have to do this to one of my pistols. <laughs> or not. I pretty much love everything black, so it's just kind of how it is. But yeah, y'all, that's it. What should we call this? Uh, space Dust Multicam? Metallic Multicam? I don't know. It's cool, though. Anyways, as always, questions, comments, concerns, leave them. And you know I'll answer accordingly. Until next time, y'all.